I'm a Zoo Sci major here at West Liberty. I'm from Berkeley County, West Virginia, and today I'm going to show you what it's like to be in this major. Let's go check out my ecology class with Dr. Lofman. Today we're studying host race speciation, and the model organism for that is an apple maggot fly. So if you see, each one of these circles represents the population of apple maggot flies. Let's check out our snake room in one of our animal care labs. So this snake is gravid and she's going to lay eggs. So if you look at the back end, see how swollen she is? Uh, those are all the eggs that she's going to hopefully lay in this lay box that we've put in there. Now we're in our gecko lab and we're going to check out Aurora. So Aurora is one of our giant geckos. And we got her as a hatchling when the program started in 2015. And she's grown up here. And the students have taken care of her and raised her. Aurora is from New Caledonia, which is an island off the coast of Australia. And that's the only place on planet Earth that these geckos are found. We have four species of geckos in this lab. And we recently had a crested gecko in hatch. loved animals and I knew for a long time that I wanted to work with them. I didn't really know in what setting and when I learned about West Liberty University Zoo Science Program I thought that would be awesome to get involved in so I came here and I've loved it. The program involves classes that are centered around animal care as well as conservation and ecology. And in addition to our classes, we also have animals here on campus where we can get involved and learn how to take care of them with hands-on experience. So right now I'm making the diet for the sloth. She eats yams and lettuce and a couple other things, but she's definitely picky. set up over here, so let's go check it out. Hey guys. <laughs> <laughs> There's not for both of you. So some of the Zeusai animals are outside today because it's really nice, so we can go take a look at them. So this is Sweet Pea, our yeah. Linnae's okay. two-toed sloth, and right now she is climbing around on her little jungle gym. These sloths are arboreal, so this is what they do. The Zoo Sci program here at West Liberty University now has two tracks. You can either go into the Applied Conservation track or the Zoo Science track, but for your first year you get a little bit of experience in both. That way you can decide which direction you want to go. Once we reach a certain number of hours with animal care here at West Liberty University, we move on to taking care of some of the animals at the Ogilvy Good Zoo. We have internships there that earn us credit um, with West Liberty, and then some of us have also gotten jobs there. I personally have gotten a part-time job there um, after my sophomore year, and I've worked there for about a year now as an animal keeper. My job is to clean all the exhibits and check on the animals, make sure they're all healthy, feed them, give them fresh water, um, and then also provide them with enrichment so that they are physically or mentally stimulated every day. These are meerkats, and this is our baby Rafiki. He's just a little over two years old. <laughs> this is Kenny. He's one of our ringtail lemurs. He's about 24 years old, so he's a little old man. These are our mongoose lemurs. They are also from Madagascar, and they are an endangered species. Because it is a smaller zoo, it's nice because um, you're able to get a good bit of hands-on experience and learn a lot. I hope this gave you a look at what it's like to be a zoo sci major. For more information, check out our website.